Last year, we had a new avenue to help facilitate troop to troop cookie exchanges. It's the cookie exchange. So you open up the cookie exchange and your, say your troop has um, 25 packages of tagalongs that you're afraid you can't get rid of. You're going to put this in by packages and you're going to update the package. It's going to show that you have those packages and it will show up, but you're looking for some lemon ups. So what you can do is do the drop down. Nobody has it right now, so you know you need to go to the cupboard to get those. Let's see, you need some Samoas. So in the system, it shows you, it shows troop numbers. So remember that first number is the area where you live. The six is the Denver area. The four is the Colorado Springs area. And um, one is Western Slope, two is Durango, Cortez, Three is Pueblo area, four is Colorado Springs, five is the mountain communities, six is Denver, and seven is the Northeast Colorado, Fort Collins on all of that area. So you see on here that Dorla has six packages. Well, you need more than that. But then Lena has five cases. She lives close to you, so maybe you're going to email Lena and do a troop to troop transfer. If you do a troop to troop transfer, the, the troop that puts it into the system will be the troop that accepts the cookies. And then the troop that gave the cookies will go into their transaction page and make sure that the information is there and it's all correct.